Hello everybody, today I'm going to show you how to install MS-DOS 3. So what you will need is three discs, and at first you need your MS-DOS boot disc. Second, you need uh, your two discs, which are for MS-DOS setup discs. Okay, so what you need to do first is put in your boot disc and turn on the computer and the computer will will uh, boot from the floppy Okay, so I'll ask you for the date. So just press enter twice. Okay, so what you want to do now is type in F disk. What this will do is it will enable you to create petitions. So just do that. Okay, so this is the F disk program. We want to display the drives. There's nothing there, as you can see. So no petitions to find. So just press escape. I want to create a petition, press enter. Or you want to create a MS DOS 3.3 .3 petition, so press 3 and then enter. Press enter again and it will say that. On default it will say why, so just press again. Press enter again. And it will do that. Insert DOS disk into drive A. Well, it's already in there. So just press enter. Okay, so I'll ask you for the new date again, so press enter twice. Now what you want to do is type in format C. Like that, okay? Now press enter. Morning, all data on whatever. This will format the drive, so just press Y and enter. And that will format the drive. It will take you some time, but on your normal computer like like that or something modern will um will take much more but since I'm using an old laptop it will take much more so I'll be back when this is done. Okay the format is complete. So what you want to do now is type in sys C system transferred. So, take out your DOS bootable disk and insert disk 1 as you can see right there. So insert the disk and now t type copy uh, star oh, star dot star c colon like that. Press enter. And this will copy the system files from the floppy disk to the hard drive. So that you have a so you can boot in the DOS. Okay, so it's copied. So take out the first disk it and insert disk two. Probably can't see that. Yep, right there, disk two. Put that in. 
And now, press F3 and enter. What F3 does is it takes the latest command you typed in and then puts it back on the screen so that you can use it again, which is very kind of it. Okay, so that's done. Take out your uh, setup disk. Leave your floppy drive blank. And now what you want to do is restart the computer. To restart the computer, you just go Control Alt Delete. But I did the hard reset, just because. Why not? Okay, it's trying to find a floppy system disk, but there's nothing in there, so we'll just boot from my hard drive. And there we go. Here's MS DOS 3, and that's about it for it. And. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.